At the Success Summit, presented by marketing consultant Steve Black, you'll learn techniques to improve your business and increase sales. Network with over 300 of the best business people in your area and make connections that will last a lifetime. Hi, I want to thank you for taking an interest to look at our website and learn about Success Summit 2011. It's going to be a terrific day, a lot of networking, a lot of great ideas and skills that you'll be able to take to the marketplace, utilize to make more money, make more connections, and have your best year ever. Remember this, unless you're learning, you're not growing. Unless you're growing, you're not truly happy. And unless you're happy, what else is there? Look forward to having you there. Thank you so much. Hi, I'm Amanda Black, and I'm one of the speakers here at the Success Summit. And we are so thrilled with the turnout today. We're so thrilled with how excited everybody is, how motivated everybody is. Um, our Success Summit is a wonderful thing to attend. It's going to give you great ideas. It's going to help you learn how to market your business better. And you're going to, best of all, come out with the best feeling in the world and the best attitude and motivated to work harder, smarter, and do more and be successful. You know, today's a, a day not only to get motivated, but to get some legitimate skills. You know, common reaction is, well, I've heard that before. That isn't the key to success. It's, are you doing it? I mean, the Colorado Rockies getting ready to play some baseball. What are they doing right now? Practicing. Practicing. And I know something about each of you. You're the best in Denver. <laughs> Give yourselves a hand on that one. Yeah. You know why I know that? Average people don't do this stuff. Average people make excuses. Average people say, I don't have the time to go to the seminar. I don't have the money to be there. So you're the best of the best. I'm uh, Ron Smith, international developer in uh, organic and coffee and tea business. I uh, love to go into the success seminars, you know, with Steve and Amanda Black, uh, awesome people. I just love my one thing that we don't have technology-wise, I want to be able to plug a USB port into his head and download all the information that he has because it's great for business, it's great for people to be able to network. And, um, and uh, when I met him a couple years ago, I had just started my Organo Gold uh, Healthier Coffee business. And, and, and since then, you know, just using some of the skills and techniques from the event, from the social media and all those types of things that I wasn't really into, you know, learn how to really get yourself out there and brand. Uh, you know, being a former professional athlete, that's a brand in itself. But when you're trying to go into a different market, you, you, you really have to brand what people are looking for. And so coming to these seminars and things like that are just awesome for, for people to see what they don't do that can really help them. My name is Matt Wallace. I'm the owner of Franchise Mart, Biz One Brokers. I'm here today at the Success Summit in Denver with Steve Black. Great meeting, great practical advice, a lot of good guest speakers. Uh, met Rod Smith today from the Denver Broncos and Courtney Berg from Courtside Consulting. A lot of really good quality practical information, stuff I'm looking forward to taking home and working on my business. Thank you, Steve. Thank you to the Success Summit. It's great to be here. Um, who here writes their goals down on a regular basis, tracks their goals, sets up rewards that support their goals? It's super important. Anybody want to take a guess at what percentage of the population write their goals down, track their goals, and have rewards that support their goals? 3%. That, those 3% have a, a, a higher net worth than the other 97% of the population. Now, who would agree that success is more than just making a lot of money? All right? It's about balance, and we'll talk about that. Who would also agree, though, that money does help you suffer more comfortably in a better neighborhood? Can I see a raise of hands? All right, so we're going to talk about that as well. Today isn't a motivational day. Today is a, a how-to day. I and mean, if we take an idiot and we motivate him or her, what are we left with? Motivated idiot. 